Welcome, welcome back, my fellow Vikings, to more Valheim! Valheim time! Valheim time! Valheim time! I know we had an extra specially long introduction last time, so we will not be doing that today. But I will recap you on what happened. I feel like we did a lot, but also not a lot. We found Hildur as well started her quest we i think i want to go get one well, i gotta get screenshots of hilder for you know thumbnail sakes and uh i also need to get another portal up and going on hilder's side of the map she's got some good stuff i am thinking about going to the areas so we've got these things howling cavern sealed tower shouldering tomb i don't know what a howling cavern is but it's really close to our first map here i'm thinking about checking it out i don't know i'm conflicted because i really want to go find yagluth and i also really want to go do a bunch of other stuff i think priority one is trying to find yagluth because if we can find yagluth then we can start kind of like preparing for a another boss battle but then again i mean hilder's quest is also just right around the corner oh yeah and we gotta drink water when we sleep i sprayed my face uh, day 206 <laughs> day 206 well i guess what we could do is we could continue to explore the island we set up all these different portals because we want to explore this entire island area we are almost out of food but what can you do? Made this little beauty last time. Yeah, we'll explore the island. We gotta go a little bit past Hilder. I mentioned this last time, but I have this absolute itch right now to play uh, Elden Ring. So if you guys want to see me finish Elden Ring next, this next month, I would say this, this month maybe, please let me know in the comments section here if you guys wouldn't mind seeing me kind of play a little bit more of that because i am kind of interested in starting that back up and playing like every single day maybe getting like five or six elden ring videos out consistently Ooh, there's a crypt right here that's nice well look at that we are in a swamp that's good to know actually i am trying to i am trying to follow the coast a little bit so i can get like the entire island down but i might i've been Ooh, 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 okay, 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 okay. Scare the crap. Dude, I swear that noise design scares me every time. I do not like this fog. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Get out of here, growth. Get out of here. Dude, the growths are so fast. Might have to start heading back to my portal. Wow, I... I've been exploring like a mad woman. I think I probably have to go back to my portal in a second. I'm not gonna have the rested buff anymore. That freaks me out. I mean, I've been really looking. I mean, I've almost explored this whole island. Let's get the rested buff back. <gasps> Ooh, another one star troll. Interesting. I don't know if this is just where he, wow, they have red eyes. That's super kind of freaky. I don't like the look of, I would say the one star trolls actually look kind of scarier than, than the two star trolls. Yeah, dude, this is freaky looking. Do you think he spawns here all the time? This is like his one star spawn area because I saw another troll that was one star and it was in this area. It was last episode. Yeah, maybe I think he just respawned. What if we go over more towards Hilder's area? What's another troll? Do you think all of the trolls in this forest are one star? Actually, I'm curious. Nope, that's just a normal troll. Onwards we go. We found the coast, so let's just, we'll just run along it until we wrap around the entire island. I told you guys that every episode we'll explore like bits and pieces at a time so we can just continue to fill out the map as much as possible. It's crazy that this is just one massive island. We haven't even actually explored all of our normal island yet. We'll actually do that today whoa i hear a troll is it a one star a one star in the plains could be pretty nice nope that's just a normal troll but you know let's let's grab him anyways come here our troll decided to leave us so i guess we're on our own oh geez i don't like this i do not like being here whoa 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 don't sneak up on me like that honestly super rude we will hug the black forest how about that i'm looking for anything that can stand out to me that looks like an altar for yagluth or even just looks like it could have a red sign 
maybe that would look like it would they would know where Yagluth is this island is just huge I didn't expect there to be all of the biomes all of them all except for the mistlands of course all of the biomes are here oh look a little tiny slice of plains that's nice it's not even a full plains just a little tiny sliver of it Ooh, there's more crypts here too we probably gotta start making our way back to our portal this is a lot of exploring for the day oh home away from home you know I didn't even think about this but what if we made like a way a ship and then we basically just went all the way over to our island oh that would still be too far away that would that would be dangerous i mean that's just crazy like see look at this mountain there's there's silver all over this side of the mountain i haven't even gone to the other side but that's black uh that's swamp then you have plains then you have mountain then you have black forest then you have meadows you have hilder more plains all right we finally get to sleep <laughs> it's been a while day 207 <laughs> day 207 i might actually have to do a bunch of stuff here i did a bunch of exploring but i need to i'm running low on food so I, I might need to just stay do some farming get some taming done so that way i can kill the loxes for meat i also need to oh geez there's a lot i needed to do actually yeah more lox pies i need to kill leeches for their blood bags let's take a look at our garden and our loxes i think the loxes need yeah you guys mentioned it the loxes need to have me by their side that way they can actually be tamed i think this garden should be done right yes boom there it is i love doing that i love just waiting for it all to sprout how are you guys doing i mean it seems like they're doing pretty good i'll make a bigger pen when they're tamed up something nicer maybe but it's time to do some farming because i need more lox pies i need a lot more everything oh <gasps> I think they tamed. I'm just going about doing my own thing here, farming like an absolute Neanderthal. And I think I heard them tame, or at least one of them did. I think I'll wait for the second chime. It's way too low for you guys to, to hear it, but I think I heard it. <gasps> there we go. It even had a notification this time. But is it like both of my loxes are tamed or just the one? All right, let's take a look, shall we? Oh, they're so cute. Lox, they're both tamed. I can go in there now. Oh, you guys are so adorable. What should we call them? Oh, hello. How do I pet you? Lox? Mmm. Mmm, what should we call them? Keep accidentally picking stuff up. I want to name them something something classic i was thinking going about going political with it but i don't really want to trifle with that very much i'll think on it if you guys want uh put some name recommendations down in the comments i will consider your options i'll put 50 flax in here so just in case i need to feed them there we go it's still farming i have to do oh these chores will never end doing a big server would be so helpful because i don't like I mean, I love being like the mother of the server, but being your own mother and your own explorer and your own strong independent Viking <laughs> is a lot to process. And I think the exploring is like, we haven't done a lot of it, but it's not super interesting to watch unless we run across a bunch of like Draugr villages, which we actually have done a lot. Surprisingly enough, this seed has so many Draugr villages and I just, Cannot imagine why. Well, it's all random. That's why. I mean, there's nothing really you can do about it. But I didn't ask for this. I didn't ask for a million Draugr villages. They're, they're pretty tough to take out. because There's just so many Draugr spawners. But if we can take a couple more of them out, I could make a couple of really big bases. That's where our base was made out of. Just a giant, just a giant Draugr camp. I think by the end of the episode, I'll go make another portal to Hilder. I think that's a good idea. Or I could just take one of my portals I currently have and put it there. That also might be a really good idea. All right, we need more blood bags. I gotta sort all this stuff out. We definitely need to go back to the mountain biome and farm mountain biome stuff too. I'm running low on 
meat skewers, and I definitely need that, but I I need more blood pudding. So we need to go kill some leeches. Best thing to do with that is just going over here. <laughs> I love that I'm, I'm right next to a swamp. All of these leeches should be respawned or maybe all of my leeches haven't respawned yet yeah i guess maybe they're all over here oh now when i don't need leeches they don't come i swear valheim knows exactly when you're looking for something and it's like yeah i don't really feel like uh giving that to you unfortunately okay here we go all you leeches not that many to begin with yet, but we'll find more. I think I heard an abomination. Did I? I think it is. Okay, so it is an abomination. I didn't get nearly enough blood bags. I need like a ton of blood bags. I need more blood pudding, Captain. It's also nighttime. It's really freaking hard to see right now. I mean, nine blood bags isn't terrible i think i can make that do but i'm not gonna have very many blood bags the are you kidding again oh come on guys not again how about you guys don't attack all of my stuff oh jesus yeah just don't attack my stuff just come after me yeah <gasps> Whoa. Oh yeah, this is nice. I really love just getting attacked by the <laughs> fueling villages again and again. Oh, there's another one over here. Oh my gosh. Oh, whoa, frame rates, frame rates, frame rates, frame rates. Holy crap. <laughs> my game is like, please stop. I'm nervous about that shaman. The horde is retreating. <laughs> That's nice. Let's get out these big boys first. <gasps> ooh, ooh. I'm the one who's always asking, can we get more black metal, please? But now the game's like, yeah, here we go. Here's some black metal for you. All right, why does the horde have to attack while I'm regenning and I don't have the rested buff? It feels like I never have the rested buff whenever the horde attacks. All right, you're freaking done. Get out of here. All right, let's collect our freaking reward. It took so much effort to do. I think that's like our fourth, no, third horde attacking our whole playthrough. And they always seem to come out when I don't have the rested buff. It's like a sign. The game's like, go, 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 move in, move in. She doesn't have a rested buff. Or it's usually always when I'm putting stuff away. I'm always putting stuff away in, in drawers and stuff. And, and in the game's like, oh my gosh, she's not ready. She's not ready. Go, 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 go. Let's be thankful that they come to us at least. And I'm not out here having to like go out and chase down black metals. Day 208. Day 208. I think I still hear feelings. How are there still feelings left? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Come here. We'll put this in our smelter. Easiest black metal I had to, ever had to not really work for. Well, I had to work for it. There was no doubt. Can we actually put our st stuff away without getting just immediately attacked and bombarded? <laughs> Please. I'm like officially out of food again. I swear we had more fish, right? Yeah, we do. Okay. Let's make more wraps. Okay, so I've been able to replenish our food just a little bit, but dang, we need to go like searching for more food stuff next time. More farming chores next time. Uh, can I upgrade? I made a I made a shield a little while ago. I don't really know what I need to upgrade this sh said shield. I need chains, fine wood, and black metal. Chain, chain, chain. I swear I have chains. Yeah, I do chains fine wood i don't think i have enough fine wood but black metal i do have oh look leeches it's like you guys come without even like be being beckoned but when i go looking for you guys you don't want to come over do you look at that four blood bags and i didn't even have to go searching for these guys what absolute joke see fit five five blood bags rude honestly upgrade now is this shield better than my current one blocking armor 84 and 72 yep there we go bada bing bada boom yeah i really like this black shield because it's it's way better so we've got 84 block armor good pierce 
I really need iron. I might take the next couple of episodes to get more iron. I don't know. It's just hard when you are kind of doing this all on your own. And farming seems to be the, the biggest thing in the game. Farming for materials, farming for just farming, just in general. Well, I wanted there to be a little bit more of a happier send off, like nicer weather. But sometimes Valheim, Valheim has its own mind shall we say. But it was really fun playing with you guys today. Thank you again for following along with the series. If you have been enjoying, what would really help out is by subscribing and of course recommending videos to other people who may also really like it. So please do that and I'll see you Vikings in tomorrow's video. Mm.